Shalom, shalom, shalom. We praise the Most High, Yahweh, by Shem, El Shai. Today's topic I'm going, to be, I'm going to be talking about today is the heathens are going into captivity only a matter of time, sick of their faces. That's when I start off this, before I get into the precepts, I'm going to say a couple of words. Because um, Eves and Jakes need to come back to the Most High. Because time's running out. You see what's happening in the world. War 3 is about to kick off. Russia and Ukraine. You can see that the, um, Russia is invading Ukraine. If Babylon soon fall, or only a matter of time. That's why us, the people, need to come back to the Lord. Follow his laws, statutes and commandments. And stop all the folly. Stop all this wickedness. Stop following, following this Babylon wicked days. And man, stop. Going out, partying, dancing, all that folly, man. Because when you're doing all that stuff, these heathens are laughing at you, man. Because like they know, they know we're special, peculiar people. But um, most of us people in the world, most of Israelites on the road, that's not in the truth. They don't know that they just want to like party. They don't want this, um, the kingdom to fall, the kingdom to end. That's why they keep on partying, doing all this folly, and. These jakes need to stop getting with these heathen, wicked, um, Shilamite women because they're not doing no good for you as well. To come back, start getting back to her, stop um, coming and taking our Israelite women and that because we've got 12 tribes of women, no, 12 tribes of Israelite women in this truth. Um, and you need jakes do when I choose these um these heathen women these um she demands other nations and yeah i'm gonna start off with the first precept this book of ezekiel chapter 39 verse 23 and the heathen shall know that the house of israel went into captivity for their iniquity because they trespassed against me therefore hid i my face from them and gave them into the hand of their enemies see that so fell there all by the sword that's basically saying that in ancient times when is when it's like an age ancient time when israel was a nation basically that we the reason why we went into captivity is because us israelites we not us but um our forefathers, most of our forefathers, brought the commandments of the Mosai. That's why the Mosai gave us to our enemies. Because that like, wasn't following the, the law, statute, and commandments. We wanted to do our own thing, just like people in this in the world. It's so, like even that when we we're at camp and that like, we tried to um gather brothers and sisters in to like hear the word. Because like we're trying to wake 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 our people up in these last days, but. They still wanna go about, about. They just wanna, it's like a, they wanna go about and pretend that they can't hear, and basically, obviously, like we get some sisters and brothers that come in, but most of the time, like most of these wicked these and jakes just wanna go past, walk past, like they can't hear anything. Living these last days, man, you need to start coming, coming to the man of the Lord and start hearing the word and start hearkening and start. Following his commandments. Uh, start for another precept. It's book of Revelation, chapter thirteen, verse ten. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the patience and the faith of the saints. Yeah, it's plain and simple. That's basically saying um that you Edomites, you all you heathens, all you people, all you heathens that led us so called not slacked, all you heathens that led us Israelites into captivity basically what goes around comes around so you had us in slavery so it's, it's payback time now 
and the Most High returns and all the all the um judgments um all the um Slake was and all the like prophecies get get fulfilled and the Most High returns. Yeah, all you Edomites and heathens are going to slavery. It's plain and simple, because like, it's only a matter of time. You have to, get, you have, they have to get that judgment because like, all the wicked and evil has to be done. If you killing our people, be raping the women in the age, in the um, in the ancient times. Plus, even now in the world, the stew, putting us to death. Our brothers in America, cops are still shooting us down, killing us, treating us like nothing, and. They rather they value they value the dogs more than us, Israelites, and it's true not not true. It's like a, um us so called black people in this world, and that because that even when, when sometimes when um Jake does the right thing, like he might call the call the police or something, um they come to his house and like, there's 50, 50, 50 um chance that he might get shot down because that like, these wicked devils don't like us people, and that like, they got them um, the evil red eye in in, in 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 them, this one I like. You wanna shoot down on the on the jakes and that. Um, get another preset. And the king's slacking him. Let me quote the um the verse. It's a book of Isaiah, chapter forty nine, verse twenty three. And the kings shall be thy nursing fathers, and their queens thy nursing mothers. They shall bow down to thee with their face towards the earth, and lick up the dust of thy feet. And thou shalt know that I am the Lord, for they shall not be ashamed that wait for me. Plain and simple. It's basically saying that we, we heathens need to be about bowing down to us, us Israelites that's out there in the highways and byways teaching should be should be ashamed because that like, should be um ashamed when the most returns and that we he even going to slavery and that that's why like should be bowing down to us so that like, I mean in the kingdom and that like, you can be like you won't be getting uh, as much judgment as the uh, other heathens that don't wanna bow down to us and that like, you still get still gonna get, Edomites are still gonna get um destroyed after a couple um hundreds of years, not um a couple of years and that. But um you have a still you'll still get a you'll get a light a light judgment for what's coming. Basically, um to start showing us respect and stop um stop trying to like um hey devils need to stop showing us respect even um the police in America need to start showing us brothers respect as well because I see it Every time I go on like on social media, Facebook, Instagram, keep saying that like, wicked police trying to um shoot down the like, eaves and us Jakes as well. Cause like even in the um Bible it states that um even the devil that would um no you white people the devil that Bible speak of because like, see the most the amount of stuff you devils not be doing and that. Like, be trying to bring in like this LGBT thing. It's, it's wicked as well, because the rainbow flag, the, the rainbow thing is that like basically it comes from the Bible, and wicked people wanna um, make it as a gay thing, and it's wicked and evil as well. Um, get another, get a last preset. I'm gonna wind down. It's the book of Isaiah, chapter 13, verse 16. Their children also shall be dashed to pieces before their eyes. 
their houses shall be spoiled and uh, their wives ravished. That's plain and it's basically saying we eat ugly, ugly, wicked, eat them like babies, though, even if they're, they're just being born. And it's when, when the Most High sets, us, sets, us, sets the time right for us, is that brothers and the truth will make us get them ugly, pink, red, eat them like babies, dash them to pieces to the stone, and that. And me, I'm, I'm waiting for that day because like, what's all that's been happening? Um, us people's been um, it's been lots of the people and the um system, the um, whole world's been calling us black. Plus, not even that, this been um, been hiding our history from us. So basically, when when I first came to the truth and I started reading the Bible, I was, I, was, I couldn't believe it, the amount of precepts that's that's coming to life and that even us as Israelites being able to um when the Mosai returns and that when he give us a the um green light we're gonna build to that be dashing these heathens babies t to the stones and that dash them to pieces and that um can't wait for that day because being we've been in slavery for way too long. Can't even remember like how many um years but it's been way too long. Judgment has to come for these these Edomites because I can see that this kingdom's falling as well because um, every time I've been, not even when I've got up, every time I walk past an Eden, like, could be a man or woman, it's, the faces look scared as hell because they know that the, kingdom, the kingdom's falling. They know that they're going, they're going into captivity. Babylon's soon fall. That's why Jake's, Eve's, that in the world need to come back to the um, wrong side and to follow the commandments. Ease as all, you need to stop stop wearing pants, leggings, showing off your happenings. To stop, you need to stop, stop, it's like you just um, start putting the dresses with fringes on, you need to start putting on skirts as well, and stop wearing trousers because evil trousers meant to be for a man. That's why when a man goes to the toilet, he zips down his um, his, his trousers, he don't. He zips down his trousers. Um, that's why. That's why the pants are made made for a man. Cause like even when you go to the toilets, you see on the um the little um the picture signs and that it says the man's got trousers on, and the woman's got a dress on. That's plain and simple. But cause of the um so called white man um confuse all the all you people um confuse all the the system. Once um he's trying to get um the man's been bam bamboozled that's why like you see a lot of eaves not even eaves like this um mostly everyone in um, this world and that you see them wearing um the woman wearing pants because they think they're in charge and that's not the case the man's the man's in charge eaves need to start come to come back to commandments and stop being wicked and evil as well because even at camp um yesterday I see some I think she was ha his hispanic she, um, can't remember what country she's from, but she's she's an Israelite. Don't know where she's coming from, but um, looked like she was running or something, or coming from the gym, and she all, she had all her hat and and she was wearing leggings. You can see what uh, behind, yeah. The brother was teaching, he rebuked her because like that was wicked and evil. So uh, a woman of truth can't just be walking past, and we don't rebuke them. We have to rebuke them because they need to um know that what they're wearing is wrong. They need to be wearing dresses and that. And when she got rebuked, she was like shocked when 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 her brother was talking to her because like we was telling we was, he was telling her to keep the commandments and that. Um, but she was just listening for a bit and then 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 she walked away and that she didn't even pull up. The brother said to pull her top down. And she didn't even pull her top down. Wicked as hell, man. Like, Lord, when she wakes up and uh, some ugly. Ugly, wicked, um, devil. She the man try to say that um, that she can wear whatever she wants and that damn devil man. That's why it's that's why Babylon's you fool man. Anyway, and I, and I close out and that and give all praises to the Most High, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahshai, Lord willing. A lot more brothers can wake up and come to the truth. Cause we're living in the end of the, the end of the days, living in the, the end of the days. 
Babylon Swing Fool. Say Shalom.